Many large carnivore populations in the European Union recovered from near extinction in the last 50 years. Their partial recovery is a conservation success story. But brown bears, the Eurasian lynx, wolves, wolverines also cause conflicts. For example, when wolves feed on livestock, or bears enter towns and on rare occasions attack people. Large carnivores are protected by law through the EU Habitats Directive. But this is not enough if those directly affected are not involved in discussions on their management. In 2014, the European Commission and land managers and herders, hunters and conservationists together established the EU platform on coexistence between people and large carnivores. The platform meets regularly and exchanges information on living with large carnivores in different settings. However, conflicts on large carnivores vary across the EU, therefore regional level dialogue is important. When we set up uh, the European platform for large carnivores, um, the basic idea was to bring together stakeholders. Now you can do that on the European level, but it's as important to, that, to do that at the regional level. Following the model of the EU platform, regional platforms were established in different countries to support local dialogue processes. In facilitated discussions, livestock breeders, hunters, conservationists, authorities and animal rights activists express and acknowledge each other's positions and problems. This allows them to jointly develop actions to improve the local situation. Although we will never agree on everything, discussions help us to find new solutions together. For example, hunting associations and hunters to be involved in conservation and research projects. The experience with the EU and regional dialogue platforms show that stakeholders working together can find innovative solutions for coexistence with large carnivores.